Hi, I'm James Preller. I'm a children's book author, and um, we're living in some really unusual times right now. One of the things uh, in my life, I've worked at home since 1990, published my first book in 1986, uh, but one of the things I get to do in my career is I visit schools, and I've been, you know, all over the country speaking to grades K through 8 for the most part, middle schools, elementary schools. And, um, you know, now I'm not able to do that. And at the same time, I understand that, you know, there's millions of children out there who are home, their schools are closed, trying to figure out their own education. And uh, so I'm going to, I believe what I'm going to do is I'm going to provide uh, a, a few online um, videos which may or may not be interesting to you or you'd like to share, that's great. Um, when I was a little boy, uh, I remember I would take like a, a magic marker or a pen and, and color in my finger, you know, color. And then you'd press that fingerprint on white paper. And there, there it is, you know, those lines and ridges and bumps. And more than a hundred years ago, uh, detectives for the FBI, Scotland Yard, they determined that they could identify people by their fingerprint, right? And I think of that, you know, as a writer, as a person in this world, you know, like they say of no two snowflakes, that no two people are exactly the same. You are unique. There is no one else in this world, on this planet, who has your thoughts, your feelings, your experiences, your family, your little brother who drives you bananas, leaving Lego pieces out in the hallway that you step on and all of that, right? No one else is exactly like you. You have something inside of you, a light that no one else in the world can put out into the world, right? So I think of that as a writer. You know, you start from within, you know, what will your mark be? What will be your fingerprint? As a writer, I think the real gift in my career has been looking at my life, my family, the people around me, and valuing that in a really unique and powerful way, you know. So I want you to really appreciate that you have stories inside you that only you can tell, nobody else. So look around, start that journal, appreciate your thoughts, appreciate the people in the world right now. No, not everyone is going to become a writer. Uh, that would be a pretty bad world if we were all writers, because nothing would get done. You know, <laughs> we, need, we need electricians, we need people who can fix things, we need builders, we need teachers, we need doctors, I don't know what your fingerprint will be, what mark you are going to leave in the world. But I do know that whatever it is, it's going to be something that only you can do. So appreciate what you have inside you and let that come out. Start a little journal today. Write down your thoughts. Um, write down your feelings, the things that make you mad, the things that make you proud, the things that make you sad. Those are often really good places to begin with your writing. Um, anyway, I wish you all good health, good luck. Um, I Thank goodness for books. Thank goodness for reading. I'm going to share some of that in other videos. Um, if there's anything I can do, please contact me. I have a uh, blog, jamespreller.com. Come visit there. You can contact me. Teachers, 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 parents, talk to me. And if there's anything I can do to somehow uh, be helpful during this time, I'm here and I'm going to try to do what I can. Thank you all very well, very much. Not very well, very much. Okay, bye.